it's not a game, it's a rich thing. Welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name's Anushka. As requested, I'm going to show you guys how I style my hair with the Dyson Airwrap. I got the latest one in the long barrel. And yeah, I'm just going to show you guys how I use it. I am literally in love. And I've been contemplating on whether to get it or not for about six months or so. So I know that I wanted it. So I went for it. And I actually signed up uh, for notifications on the website directly from the Dyson website and uh, it popped up one day I was literally at Tesco and I saw it and I was checking out as I was doing my um, checking out my shopping and I got it so I was quite lucky today's post notification shout out is going to go to Alicia Oli Bucks so thank you so much for hitting that bell button I really appreciate it and if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so this is what the Dyson box looks like so luxe honestly like it comes with like suede inside and um ignore how i uh, put this in um i'm not really neat that way but it comes like this i got the blue one i don't even know guys i went on the website i cannot find it i know there's been a major stock issue but if i can find it online i'll link it but i paid 479 i wanted to find it online so i can talk through the attachments but i literally can't find it and i threw away my paper this is a safety guide i don't want that this is the on and off button and then if you push all the way up it's the cooling button and then you have like the heat uh settings and the blow dryer settings super easy and i love that you can just flick it up and then have the cooling setting straight away so yeah, and then you get your plug these ones have a bit slightly different attachments um but yeah i've got the long barrel I, I i could not get away with the short one so if you have like hair up to here i definitely recommend the longer one um so yeah you get like a thinner one which gives you tighter curls and i like this one's my favorite it gives you more like a blowout curl then you've got your classic well i'm sure if there's hair on it but you've got your classic blowout brush i don't know what these are called so I, I don't even i can't i don't have anything to refer to so bear with me i'm so sorry guys but i will link it down below this is one of the newer attachments it's called the flyaway attachment and it this is what i use to blow dry my hair and also like this smooths down flyaway so whenever i do my hair especially because i have a middle parting there's lots of hairs that stick up so you just go like this and it just smooths it all out it's so good i don't i rarely use these brushes to be honest but they're just basic brush attachments i think this is good if you have more like maybe curlier hair yeah i don't really use them they do move in the direction um that you're brushing your hair in i've used this just to do like a smooth out but yeah i just i literally used this last time when i just wanted to dry my hair and it kind of straightens it a little bit but it doesn't do much for me at least and i luckily i have really straight hair but if you have like wavy hair and you're trying to smooth out your hair with this i don't feel like you would get much result so yeah my my most used attachments is the flyaway one this and this one you do get this as well which is to clean the filter i haven't really reached since i bought this now it's been over like two months now i haven't reached out to for any of my other hair uh tools i just love this so much and every time i do my hair i get so many compliments when, when i do my hair with this so yeah let's get started because my hair's like drying now and i need to put some products in i'm going to start off with my heat protecting spray this is by vo5 put this all over and i think the technology behind it is that it uses more air than heat but it does you do get some heat but not as much and i don't know what it is like when i blow dry you feel like it's not doing anything but before you know it it's dry your hair's dry and it dries my hair quicker than a usual like strong 2200 watt hair dryer so it's definitely doing something i don't know what it is but i'm drying here and i'm like what is going on here and then before i know it it's dry so the thing is and i have tested this out my hair's dead straight and no matter what curling tools or what tools i use it's gonna drop out and by the next day it's straight again and ugh, guys i've tried so many things even when i go to salon it drops out the next day and when i went recently to headmasters uk which is a salon they didn't they did invite me but um 
the girl that did my hair she was so sweet and she used this on my hair this is by paul mitchell this is their flexible style sculpting foam i would never buy this myself like i wouldn't know what to do with it but she was running this through my hair whilst it was damp this is what it looks like i got the extra large bottle this was gifted by the way luckily but i would have bought it myself anyways yeah if it's gifted or not like i will still go buy this i cannot live without this anymore but yeah i give it a good shake and what this does is like it kind of helps your hair remember the style so like once you put this in your hair and you style it it like just helps your hair remember it and it doesn't fall out and this has kept my blowout for like three plus days so i just run this through my hair now it does give a slight stiffness if you put too much but if we put too little i realize it doesn't help like you need to put a good amount of this stuff in and she just foams up like this it's so different to what i'm used to because i've never put stuff like this in my hair but i'm telling you it works my hair holds with this stuff and i've tried the air wrap without this and it looks good the first day but the next day it's just all gone out and that's whether i use my curling iron whether i use my um the only thing that holds for days is my straightener because my hair's already straight that's a good amount i like to put more on my ends i've got a middle part here so with these new attachments as well, it's better than the old one because you don't have to switch between the barrels for the direction of the, the, the dryer because obviously when you're doing this side you want the air to flow that way, if you're doing this side you want it to flow this way or you could just control it however you want and you don't have to switch between the barrels whilst this one you have this thing on the top where you can just turn it. So I'm just gonna, you know, it's so weird. When you put this on, it sounds like you're at the dentist. The the noise is so different. But yeah, I'm gonna just uh, blow dry my hair. So once it's like, I would say 80% dry, and then I'm gonna touch my larger barrel in there. I'm just going to cut out a section. So I want the first piece to go outwards. What I do is I hold it for like 10 seconds on the heat, high heat, and then I do like a five second cold and just put it out really. So with this one, I'm going to go inwards. I, I'm going to bring the curl inwards rather than outwards. And I just switch between layers, really. And then... Look how cool it is. This is... Like, what the hell? Look at that, beautiful. It gives such a nice shine as well. So for the last top layer, I like to bring the back section forward like this, and we're gonna bring it upwards it's 
gently pull it out gives such a nice bounce and then for this section I want it out of my face that's what I want it out so I'm gonna try and do it like not too bad that's exactly how i wanted it so i'm gonna brush it out and it does drop a little bit but this is one side it's really hard to see on black hair so yeah i'm gonna do the other side and i'll be right back okay that's all done look at the for you <sighs> If you ask me, it's so worth the money. And one thing that I love about it is that I don't have to use both arms as you would with a curling iron. You can just go like this. And then literally done. It took me around 30 minutes to do all my hair, but I do definitely separate them in sections and I take my time because I want it to hold. Just gonna smooth the top bit. have to do this step but I like it when it's all like like incorporated I don't really put any hairspray but you can do if you want to but yeah this is gonna last me a good two three days I would say I definitely recommend the Dyson it's definitely an investment but it's so worth it I love it so much that's how I do my hair with it and I really hope you found this kind of tutorial helpful make sure to give it a like so you can reach more people out there and if you haven't already make sure to subscribe so you can join the family and i will see you in my next video thanks so much for watching